Good Wednesday morning to you folks from uh, Cochiti Lake, New Mexico. Temperature about 34 degrees right now. It is, I'll tell you in a second, about 7.05 a.m. Sun coming up right there. I had to put the blinds down because the sun was shining through the window and messed up the lighting, so to speak. But anyway, uh, I can't say, hey, Google, because my Google is taking a break. <clears throat> but... Yeah, it's a little cool outside. It's probably about 35 outside, but no wind. Thank goodness. The wind is, today is light winds. I'm probably going to go into Santa Fe today to a grocery store called Sprouts and uh, do some grocery shopping. And while I'm in Santa Fe, I'll, of course, do a couple of videos on something. And then uh, on and on it goes. So anyway, we got... Uh, Andrew Silver. What do you got, Andrew? Andrew says, we've stayed there when we visited Kasha Kutui Tent Rocks National Monument on our way to Bandelier National Monument. Both are fantastic. Yeah, the uh, Tent Rocks <clears throat> Monument is a pretty good little hike, about four hours round trip, and there's some little narrow passages. So, yeah, uh, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> No, 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 no. I did it a long time ago. <clears throat> Rita Richardson, nice place. Looks very clean. It was really bad wind last night in California. Probably will head your way. Well, we've already had it. Thank you. We don't need any more. You, you can keep it. You just keep your little wind all to yourself. <laughs> so anyway, but Brenda Coetta, rusty windsock at 416. What's the pole with a rope hanging down with a set of pulleys that's on Cochiti Lake flagpole versus windsock hanger upper lol love that park it's so nice somebody does the footwork for a road trip planning <clears throat> thanks for tour you're welcome Brenda Tracy Phillips you're a hoot Rusty good video well I'm hooting all right uh, anyway Strongland Speed X says uh, that park ranger lady catches Rusty with a brew and off to see Chief Thunder Thud for you. Nice little poetry there. <clears throat> yeah, you have to abide by the rules. I abide by all the rules all the time, everywhere I go. Anita J. Hi, Rusty. I'd be curious to see a list of some of your favorite free Kindle books. At first, when saw you read with Kindles, I thought that doesn't sound like cost-conscious Rusty. But now I see you find plenty of free books thanks and i'm really enjoying your videos well the reason i got the kindle I mean, a long time ago is you can enlarge the type <clears throat> and a lot of the books i wanted to read didn't have the large print <clears throat> also on the kindle a lot of the old stuff that i read somerset mall mall passant uh i don't know uh, balzac and some of the other stuff that i read <clears throat> they're free Mark Twain, you can get for nothing. And so, yeah, I, that's all the stuff I, I read. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> and the one I've got now, the Kindle I have now, is what's called a paper white, which is a backlit, so I don't have to have a light when I'm reading at night. The, the thing is backlit, <clears throat> just like the keyboard on my Acer CB515-1HTP39B laptop Chromebook. Okay, Julius Cadillac. What is the brand and model of your RV? This is a Coachman Clipper Cadet 16FB, which means front bedroom. It's a 16 footer. Cost me $9,750. Dreaming Angels Reborn. Windy and warm here. Nice video, Rusty. Thank you. Robin Ravel. I'm just south of you in the White Sands area. Blew a gale today. Yeah, it did for me too. <clears throat> All over New Mexico. How about that? The whole state got it. And even in Texas. Sylvia, so if we quit our job and retire at 62, this is on Social Security, what about medical health coverage? You won't have any unless you pay for it. Medicare doesn't kick in until 66, 67. I believe you're right. I didn't have any. I just didn't have any coverage. That's all. I've done that all my life. Well, let's see, since uh, since I was age 49 to 65, I had no health insurance at all. Zero. Did I get sick? No. Did I go to the hospital? No. Did I go to a doctor? No. Zanek Gwen, I live there 
I don't know, this is driving somewhere. Okay, hello, good for you. Cajun Jameis, enjoyed it, Rusty. Pizza for supper sounds mighty fine. Yeah, it was good. It was pretty tasty. Of course, as hungry as I was, I could have put ketchup on a rock and probably done pretty good. Uh, this is Joe Blow. <clears throat> it's uh, pronounced Cochiti. It is. You're right. It's Because I asked them, I said, is it Cochiti or Cochiti? And she said, it's Cochiti. Yeah. Thank you, Joe Blow. Catchy name. Woo. <clears throat> Where'd you come up with that one? <clears throat> TT Boy 2004. Now there's another winner. Uh, why? What is the reason why they don't sell liquor on the reservation? Religious, cultural, health? Uh, well, it has a lot to do with a, the genetic uh, problem. It, it, there's a gene that uh, Native Americans possess that uh, if they if they drink alcohol, the chances of them uh, developing alcoholism are very high. <clears throat> A lot of Native American alcoholics. Paul Harrington, the 2018 Travel Light. These are nice. Yeah, they are. Madeline Vegas, comment call. Hi, Rusty. Hi, Madeline. Tracy Phillips, you can make dumping poo interesting, my f f friend. Your number one fan watching from Fort Smith. <clears throat> well, thank you, my number one fan, Tracy. This is Wanda Thurman. Comment call. Way to go, Rusty. Just keep being you. Well, I can't change. <laughs> I mean, I'm it. I may be selfish, too. I like going when I want to, where I want to. Thank you for the good videos. Very nice camp. It is okay. Here. Uh, Cochiti, Mark H. Thumbs up. Thumbs up to you, Mark H. John K8JGG. Pizza. Yummo. Yeah, it was. It's good, too. It was like, uh, for a medium deep dish, it was like $14. A little pricey, but, you know, come on. Let them make some money. I don't care. <clears throat> I mean, it'll, I'll be able to make four meals out of it, or five. Mike Butterfield, Rusty, the Piutes sell legal marijuana here. The Washu tribe would pack up and walk up to Lake Tahoe to spend every summer. Well, that's good. I mean, I'm glad they do that. Thank you, Mike. Mr. Winger, 1951, golf is a good walk spoiled. That's Mark Twain quote. Yeah, I'm familiar with that one, and he's absolutely correct. Cochiti Pueblo. We have sprouts here in San Diego. The one in San Diego, the vegetables aren't very good. Interesting. Thank you, Rocomo One. I've never been to a sprouts. We're going to go to one. <clears throat> or I may have. I think I went to it one time years ago. Heading, I don't buy that much anyway. Uh, heading my way, Rusty, I was referring to Bugs Bunny saying he made made a wrong turn in albuquerque oh okay well see how do we how do i know you're referring to bugs bunny i, I, I didn't read his book uh jerry hickey i like your drive through and explanation of miscellaneous stuff rv parks as you travel across new mexico i was at rockhound park in Deming, new mexico last fall and plan to go to other parks in the near future i have been keeping a record of the different parks that and the info you have provided thanks for what you do makes it a lot easier when you know what to do before you get there yeah it does but i've just done this so long i've been to most of these places so and and every now and then i'll hit a new one and sometimes i get burned sometimes i hit a loser <clears throat> roy vanoy be that as it or be that as it may the landscape is called natural landscape lol okay well i couldn't think of the word that's on the Cochiti Pueblo. Roy Vinoy, back in my day, living in the Southwest, the Native Americans were all poverty stricken and lived in rundown housing. Good to see life has gotten better. Well, now, some tribes live better than others, okay? Uh, believe me, some reservations are, are, are not so poverty ridden as others. <clears throat> some of them are pretty wealthy, in fact. Carry a, carry a walker. Glad you are, are enjoying yourself. I am. Strongland Speed X. Where are the people? Sure you, you're you not in the twilight zone? Uh, you could be. See, there's a little shimmering out in the desert. Sometimes you see it, you know, the little, when the heat comes rising up, it makes a shimmering. If you walk through that shimmering, you go into to the fourth world. <clears throat> Check it out. Uh, Mike Brandenburg, nice campsite and nice weather. Strongland Speed X. Fact was, Michael Jackson's favorite vocalist was Slim Whitman. Well, I really care about this. <laughs> Michael Jackson. What a worm. Rita Richardson. 
Wow, you got that pizza. Yeah, I did. Sounds good. Once in a while, pizza is okay. You managed to have quite a bit of fun. I'm envious as hell. Well, get out and do it. Clubhouse is nice. I would have ran in for a cold beer to eat with my pizza. They don't sell beer there. <clears throat> then I then I then I'd say be that as it may. LOL. Gotta go. It's beer thirty here too. Thank you for taking us along. You're very welcome, Rita Richardson. Rondlin 100, what a great looking campground. We have a lot more trees here in Tennessee, but the campgrounds don't seem to be as clean and modern. Well, this just happens to be a Corps of Engineers place, and they, they got a little money. <clears throat> Wanda Thurman, time to throw your feet up and enjoy your beer and pizza. Enjoy the view. Beautiful place you're at. Actually, I don't drink beer with the pizza. I, I'll, I'll love it. Have a little glass of red wine and get my little Kindle reader out, read a book, and eat a piece of wine, uh, pizza. Not bad. Rondon 100, enjoyed the drive through the subdivision. Rusty, always fun to see how folks live in places we don't. Did you say her name was Hoochie Koo? <clears throat> no, I didn't say her name. I, I just made that crap up. <clears throat> Kenna Mac, uh, 1413, Swamp Cooler, yeah. That's what that is. That's what a lot of people call them, is swamp coolers. Linda Lanasa, is it always that windy there? No. <clears throat> In the desert, it does get windy a few days, a month. Not bad. I mean, it's just the way it is in deserts. <clears throat> Paul Shalosky, speaking of healthy foods, I just bought some Health Valley Organic Soups with no salt added if you're looking for a healthy soup. Bought me the vegetable soup. Well, I stick with, I get Amy's, uh, organic stuff and it's it doesn't have much sodium in it mike butterfield watch out for hoochie coochie girls hoochie cochiti girls okay i got it <laughs> mark h thumbs up again thank you may crab crabe i guess or crab it is a lovely place rusty yeah it is i like it uh paul harrington the first house you see in the video had a garage for an rv look like it he has lots of stuff, as you say. Well, most people that live, <clears throat> most people that live in big homes, they got to fill that vacant spot with something, so they buy a lot of stuff. You know, Vanjie Lee, I like your response to a comment about if you would wish Ms. Rusty to travel with. I am sure you are tired of this type of questions, because I am tired of this type of questions myself about my life. I was hoping that this would will stop when I reach a certain age, but I see now that it will never stop. Apparently, I don't care. It's you know what it is. <clears throat> it's it's the way our culture is. You know, you're supposed to get out of high school, get married, and have four kids, okay, and work for thirty years somewhere, and then and uh, retire and die within six months. And and that's if you do if you do anything outside of that, then people want to know why. Cajun Jameis ordered pizza with everything. Did you get those little fishies? Nope, I don't get those. Nope. Banji Lee, I like your idea of staying in the middle lane when towing an RV. You're not breaking any rules. No, I know that. I go the speed limit. I go right down to where I want to go. I'm fine. No, no, no. I'm not going to change my driving habits. <clears throat> I'm fine. And the older I get, the more cautious I'll get, and that's the way that'll be. L.W. Lavelle, <clears throat> I wish... I wish you have paused the camera and then b brought it out to view your setup. Thanks for the detailed information on this great camping site, LW. You're welcome. Pat, <clears throat> evening, Rusty. That was really a nice tour of the area, but all I was thinking of toward the end was that your pizza, it was getting cold. Oh, that's okay. What I do, I bring it home, and I got an old iron skillet thing, about this, about this thick cast iron, belonged to my mother, grandmother. It's old, old. And I just put it on the stove and heat that up and put a slice of pizza or two on it and put my little dome top on it. They're good. It'll keep it warm for hours. Thank you, though. <clears throat> Cajun Jameis, be that as it may, 10 cents a gallon. It went up. Yeah, it did. They went up, up on the price here. Mike Butterfield, the word Paiutes and Shoshone have for whites is Tybo or Tebow, Tybo, whatever. <clears throat> yeah, every, every, every culture has a a label for foreigners uh, in uh, in uh, uh, is it Japan it's called Gaijin and uh, in Hawaii it's called Hali uh, in uh, Mexico there we're called gringos and it, it's the same way all over the world you know we have names for people too it's the way it is Curtis Bird 
show the pizza, that's why I watch the video. <laughs> I've already, well, I've already put the pizza away. I thought about that afterwards, though. <clears throat> Zeroscape. Yeah, Zeroscape. Richard Roth. Uh, those are the nicest home I've ever seen on a reservation. Beautiful place. Can't believe no one was on the golf course. Looks like a very nice course. Well, the reason it is a nice course, and it's usually pretty busy. But the reason there was no one there yesterday is because the wind was blowing so hard you couldn't, you, you couldn't, and you wouldn't have enjoyed yourself at all. Tracy Phillips, great driving video, Rusty. You keep me intrigued. Thank you, Tracy. Dick David Bricky. Uh, hey, Rusty, download Gas Buddy on your phone to check out gas prices. I may. Well, the only reason I don't download it, I could have, uh, is because it, they want everything. You know, they want to be access everything on your phone, and I don't want apps that access everything on my phone. Why? Because that's just the way I am. That's all. <clears throat> And if I pay a few pennies more, I'm not going to break out in the hives. I might, but maybe not. Wesley Bullock, ridiculously overpriced. He's talking about the Travel Light 2018. PJ Frog's got two. You must have come through Albuquerque on I-25 headed to Santa Fe. And I'm guessing to Taos. Nope, not going to Taos yet. Too cold. Got another place to go, though. Don't worry. PJ Frog, it's pronounced Cochiti. Yeah, it is. It's pronounced Cochiti. Another interesting golf course in this community. It is an interesting golf course. Kimberly P. I had a good time on this ride along. I like the bright colored houses, landscape with cacti and rocks. I hope you enjoyed your beer and pizza with everything on it. I did. I really did. It's fine. PJ Frog. Wind is just really, wind is just really up and going mostly in the springtime. Yeah, well, it is springtime. That's true. But where seasons are changing. <clears throat> Mike Butter, Butterfield, okay, he says, Rusty, here's a knock-knock joke. You finish it. <clears throat> I hear you. Who's there? I have no clue. I, I, I fall for that. Yeah, say knock-knock, <clears throat> then you say who's there, and then they don't know. Tom Wilson, they're called swamp coolers. My brother has one on his place. Yes, that tells me he lives in the desert or dry. Uh, Lindsay Montgomery, enjoy your new R-Pod 179. I've enjoyed my 2016 for 179 for two years now and love it uh yeah that was uh charles uh from valley of the fires yeah he had he had one uh susan pitt susie pittman is that enough truck uh you're gonna have to ask charles about that he seems to think it's fine <clears throat> soji soji very very nice i want to buy but i don't know how it's possible he's talking about the tiny home video i did uh star scream on living in a truck he says you dirty sticker rat really how about that sherry from texas <clears throat> don't be hard on yourself for not remembering words i think you meant zero scaping i did uh, you probably just needed beer 30 and a pizza with everything no actually what it needs about 40 years off my brain Scotty's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's go, Scotty. Cool comment call. Thank you. I might be on Adult Bowling League again, Rusty. Good for you, Scotty. Hang in there, bud. Cool Cochiti Lake, New Mexico drive through campground driving your truck, Rusty. Thank you, Scotty. Cool comment call, Rusty. Thank you, Scotty Thompson. Do you ha have a tablet, Rusty, still? Yes, I do. I have an Acer CB15 1HT P39B Chromebook. Uh, Co cool Cochiti Pueblo, New Mexico. Let's take a look at driving your truck, Rusty. Thank you. Uh, Scotty Thompson, boo. Uh, Scotty Thompson, ooh, he's got I O O. I don't know what that one is. <clears throat> Whatever that is. Thank you, Scotty Thompson, for your lovely comments. I always appreciate it. Thank you. Um, and Blades, when you go to Sprouts, check out the homemade Alfredo pasta. If you try it, you'll be hooked. I got chicken on mine. Maybe not your style, quality, ingredients. Enjoy. Just remember that you have no microwave to eat the Alfredo in. But their roast chicken is great, too. Enjoy. Okay, thank you, Amblaze. Der Trixa, interesting trip. Thank you for sharing. And greetings from Germany. Der Trixa, thank you. Greetings from Cochiti Lake. Uh, Tracy Phillips, Rusty, I'm glad you're enjoying life. Great video. I am, too, because it's running out. Uh, ben O. Show, Rusty78609, you sure travel through Indian Territory with such ease. That was a nice little trip, very very pretty sights. It is nice, and, you know, and I, I do that for myself just as much as I do it for y'all because I like to see how people live and, you know, what's going on. 
Mark Reynolds, nice video, Rusty. Mark Reynolds, nice video. And then Linda Lou, where are you? Zero, zero scaping is what it's called without a lawn on Long Island. Thanks for the tour. You're welcome, Linda Lou, where are you? This is Lee Cook. I have the same truck. He's talking about mine. He's got a 2017 Dodge Ram. <clears throat> I have the same truck. I'm getting 19 miles an hour, what, 19 miles per gallon. What's the difference? You drive more highway miles, I take it? No, <clears throat> probably not. Number one, I drive slow. I drive 55 miles an hour, okay? Number two, when I leave a red light, it's not a jackrabbit start, okay? Uh, I, I try to, I try to, I, I don't work at mileage, but I get 25 miles a gallon, honest. I do. And when I'm towing, I've been getting above uh, 14, so that's really good. But anyway, for all you guys that left comments, thank you very much. And for those of you, uh, oh, thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye, 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 anything your little heart desires. But if you think about it and you want to, you can use the Amazon link in the description of my videos and buy stuff from Amazon, and I get a small commission, and it doesn't cost you one penny more, okay? And for those of you that have done that, thank you, thank you, thank you. And what else? Drink plenty of water. Three or four quarts a day will not hurt you. It's good for you, and out here in the western USA, it is good for you. Uh, it'll help you avoid gout, kidney stones, and it'll also help you lose weight if that's what you need or want to do. And what else? <clears throat> Take deep breaths. Breathe in deeply, hold it for a few seconds, and breathe out slowly. Why? Because that relieves stress, and relieving stress lowers your blood pressure, and that's good for you anywhere in the whole wide world, okay? And then what else? Stretch, 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 walk, walk, walk. You know, you'll keep your body in motion, or at least do something every day. And uh, for exercise, good for you, because you want to keep your health. You know, it's, all this stuff at the end of the videos is always about just keeping your health, because without your health, you're not going to be watching my videos, one. Number two, you're not going to be doing anything, okay? So what else? Stand guard at the door of your mind because what you let in are ingredients. Don't let negative Nancy or negative Ned dump garbage in your head. And for the people on the news media that are just, that prey on negativity, and they do, and the reason is they get you upset and they work on your emotions, okay? <clears throat> this is your mind. Turn them off. Turn them off. You, you'll never miss them, okay? I guarantee you. I haven't watched any news in years. Okay, I mean, every now and then I might do something on Google, my home, my Google news page, but rarely. My Google news page has news from some sources that are, there are no major news sources on my Google news page. No New York Times, no LA New Times, no uh, Dallas Times, Herald, no CNN, no CNBC, no Reuters, no Fox, no nothing. Okay, these come from little old bitty newspapers all over the United States. And then most of it is crap, and I very rarely even go to it. But anyway, having said that, enjoy your life one day at a time. Adios from Cochiti uh, Lake in New Mexico. Bye-bye. Enjoy your life, guys. We're going to do something today.